Uh, hello, ladies and gentlemen. The kids in bed. It's time for story time, and uh, we are playing Paper Mario, Super Paper Mario. Except that Mario has died. He gave up on his quest and decided he was done with this. You can't see him. You can't see him. He's gone. You can't see him. Oh, wow. oh, there he was! Yeah, I didn't right, realize hey. I could jump and crouch at the same time. Oh, I thought you were being. I thought you were joking. I didn't know you were actually. <laughs> Can you, um, see? Can you see me? Can you see me? Speaking of now you see me, I do want to see that movie. Oh my goodness. All right, let's go ahead and shove that heart up the pillar. I point out that the graphics for these Mario games are, the, the Paper Mario games always have like oddly nice graphics. Like they aren't super flashy, but they have like just nice touches that it's really appealing. I really like it, personally. Oh, yeah. And the cool way that they kind of blend 2D and 3D as well. Well, the gone door is now more door, so... <laughs> what? I've never heard that one before. Let's return to Merlin. Let's not, though. No, the I'm thing about that. Hey, talk to that dude. What does he say? He probably says something dumb. Uh huh? Weird things in the sky? Wasn't there yesterday. Did a cloud blow up? Yeah, what am I talking about? If a cloud blew up, we'd be wet, right? Really? Clouds don't really blow up like that. Hey, you know anything about the weird block stuff in the sky? Block stuff? It looks kind of scary, but I don't know what... Uh, bye. Wait, you have to go down? But we need to go up. Oh, you have to go down to go left, go right, and then go up, I think, right? It's been sure. years since I've played this game. It has not been years. Yeah, it has. Since you played this game? Okay, maybe. And even since you played the game, our daughter wasn't born then. Yeah, but she's not that old. She's more than a year. Yeah. Speaking of daughter, this bedtime. Ooh, a safe lock. Perhaps you should something, because... Strike this block. <laughs> Hit the block to save all your bro... I'm not reading that. We know how to save block locks work. You should know how to save block works. Um, to be fair, when I'm reading out loud, I intentionally stop myself from reading the whole thing, because normally I read really fast, but when you're reading out loud, you can only, you know. So when she skips past, I'm not actually reading all the text, I'm trying to read out loud. I'm not a natural reader. I don't like speaking, oddly enough, and I don't like reading out loud. Ah, the two of you return. Hmm. I, Cloudface, will now tell you that a door has appeared. Look, a door has appeared. <laughs> This dimensional door was made to lead the hero to another pure heart. Wait, are there other dimensions that the doors don't lead to, though? Yes. Somewhere about, beyond this door lies one of the seven pure hearts. You like a, an affirmative, affirmative um, explanation, uh, exclamation yes, just before doing this? indeed! Tippy, you must use your power to help Mario find the pure heart and return here. Of course. Yeah. Hmm. Yay. And Mario, I have something to give you that will aid you on your journey. Mm. I've got fat. <laughs> a magical pipe that returns you to Flipside from afar. With this, you'll be able to return to Flipside from anywhere <laughs> in the universe. Mm. Yeah. Use it whenever you feel you must return in a hurry. Mm. <laughs> okay, yeah, we, we get it. You use, the, you use the pipe, you get to go back. The light prognosticus foretells that the hero will meet a dimensional governor. From him, the hero will learn the dimensional technique. While certain this refers to my Flynn, Flynn, friend, the Flynn wizard, <laughs> Bestovius, who will best. bestow upon you his Bestovius power. Go through the door and seek out Bestovius. Well, let's get going. There we go. Oh, oh he jumps goodness, stupid look eye. How high I can jump. <laughs> look how high I can jump. Bye. Oh, bad things are happening. <laughs> the, the void has been ripped in the dimensional fabric. I don't think I read that correctly. Yes, Count Black Count is bleak. Black. You are way off. <laughs> the game has foretold in the dark. The bad dad this. Oh my goodness, you are bad at this. Shush, I don't want to hear it. Now it's just a matter of time until all worlds meet their demise. Yeah. <laughs> wow, that's just super Count. Yeah, first you'll erase all these naughty worlds. What? Naughty worlds. And then you're gonna build a perfect world without war and all that other icky stuff. 
Yes, yes. No one likes the icky stuff. Yes, a perfect world. Sounds magical. <laughs> I can hardly stand the wait. I don't like that guy. Sorry I'm late! Poof! Oh, what? What the blazing bog rats? How'd I beat myself here? What's going on? <laughs> I, I don't know how to... <laughs> oh, chunks, you silly... Did you oversleep or something? It's kind of hard all to be on time, though, when you've got muscles instead of brains. Hey! You can't fool me with that crazy shape-shifting hooliganry bree. It's Mimi, ain't it? Show a little respect for your count. Yeah, you go bar in his face, lass. It's funny, it's like, my voices for them are not consistent. I'm not a voice actor. No, not I'm not a voice actor. <laughs> How delightful, Mimi. Almost as dapper as Count, count Black. Black. Are we really gonna do this all game now? Oh, golly, thanks, Count. With you around, it's nothing but big smiles all the time. Hanging out with a Count is my idea of a perfect world. Oh, yay! And here I thought Mimi's ideal world was gem filled pool with hunky lifeguards. Hey, Dimitrio, you've been reading my diary? I mean, oh, never mind. <laughs> well, different stokes for different minions. After these rotten worlds are ended, Count Black will make your dreams come true. You didn't. You failed. But for that to happen, we must follow the instructions of the bar. Dark Prognosticus! Okay, okay yeah. I was just trying to go with a different word. It's not working. <laughs> yeah, about that. Just an FYI, uh, I got an urgent memo from your, memo from your inbox. <laughs> Shut it. Don't want to hear it. Apparently, there's been some unapproved interdimensional activity lately. Yeah. I'm thinking it's the heroes of the prophecy. We're gonna need an action plan for this guy. Kill him. The dimensional interloper. And possibly the hero? Are you sure of. Hmm. Nastasia? Nastasia? I didn't know that was her name. Interesting, mused Count Black. We must put an end to this nuisance. Who's calling Count Black? Well, let me get it right in the brain. This arrow Nastasia's gun about. You're he your enemy? Then he gotta cut me loose and Okay, I can't I can't I can't read with his thing. Give her a nice taste of O Chunks. Very well, O Chunks. I leave you, the hero chunking to you. Do not fail, Count. Count Black! Black. <laughs> you can count on me, Count. I'll rain down like fat thunderstorm, I swear it. I'm not sure if he's supposed to be like I, I, I can't redneck or Irish or I've been like I, I feel like redneck type accent, but I'm just having a really hard time forcing that one out of me. <laughs> Mimi, Dementia, you should tag along. You can't witness a proper chunking. Chunk. Hmm, I do enjoy a good chunking. Well then, I believe I'll head out as well. <laughs> so, hero, you would defy Count Black. Then hurry, for your world's end draws near. <laughs> I, I I can't keep a consistent voice. I feel like people watching this are gonna get so mad at me. Mario was called upon once again to save the world. No small task. Could he prevent Count Black from pulling off his sinister plot? Would Mario reunite with Princess Peach? A truly interdimensional adventure was about to begin. <laughs> your voice got deeper as you went. <laughs> You're like, chapter one, yay! A whole new world. No. 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 Flowers. It's Flowey the flower. No. Dun, 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 dun. I feel the pure heart, but it's still far from here. Merlin told us to find his friend, Vestovius, to learn the interdimensional technique. I think I'm gonna stop with the voice acting and just read it in my voice. We better go find him. Maybe slight, slight things. One more thing. If you wanna learn about anything, just use my power. I know about many things. Well, aren't we at know it all? Point your Wii remote at the screen and tip you will focus on wherever you point. And then just press A over anything framed in red to hear about it. If we ask Tippy about anything, blah, blah, blah. I don't think there's anything over here, no. Oh yeah, you got a mushroom! Hey. 
Oh, they are items in this one. I forgot. I would have waited until after you could go. You still jump stupid. You can still do it. You just have to go harder. Oh, that was boring. Don't jump on that one. You need it. I didn't mean to jump on it. Do you have, like, experience in this one? I think so, yeah. See this four? Not you, sure. like, level up every time it hits a certain number. Question mark. This is not an empty house. Something. Blah, blah, blah. Don't really care. Let's look around. Let me find hidden things. Yeah, I know she will be finding hidden things. I'm just tired of reading out loud, honestly. <laughs> There's a giant door here. Let me make it visible for you. Thanks, Tippy. Wow, Tippy, you're so useful, Tippy. So glad we have you, Tippy. You're so condescending. I'm not condescending. I'm never mm -hmm. condescending. Mm hmm? I, Cloudbutt, so will talk to you. That stands before me. And, and how, how does, does it have the audacity to address my multicolored glory? How do these flimsy whiskers detect my secret door? Exclamation? <laughs> oh, gosh. Wait right there. Wedge shirt, conspicuous white gloves, jaunty cap. Ha! You are garbed in the rich cloth of the hero of prophecy. You must be the great hero... Impersonator! <laughs> what a costume. You look like you lived out of the pages of the Prognosticus. <laughs> this is Mario. He's dressed like this because he is the hero. Merlin told us to find you. Merlin? Merlin? Only oh. his full-bodied beard rivals my hairy magnificence. If Merlin thinks you this are the true hero, button. you probably are, I think. Well then, as the ancient prophecy foretells, I, Bestovius, will bestow upon you the ancient secrets of dimensional flipping. For an amount of 10,000 coins. Say no to all of that. But that's preposterous. You can't charge us to teach us the hero of something I don't care about. Why what? not? Even the great and splendiferous Bestovius okay, has nope. certain expenditures. Why should <laughs> nope, the hero nope. get the world delivered to him on a well-garnished platter? These heroes think they can get away with shaking people down for free skills. A mere 10,000 coins should be nothing for a hero of the universe. What do you say? Uh, I don't think I have 10,000 coins. I see. Oh gosh, my so voice acting as bad as it was is better. I will settle for just taking all the coins in your pocket. Do we have a deal? Oh. Good job. Skin tillage. Good. Let us begin. I don't think I had any points in my book. I, I think have I like had two like or three. two. Flimity flamity flum. Diggly daggly doom. Zippity zappity zoom. Sure All right, Cloud, but you, you can quit now. Flip out. Oh, maybe that actually was a spell. Oh, whoa, cool. We just got a new power. Woo! I, Bustovius, have granted you the ability to flip between oh, dimensions. Oh, I hate him so much. Press A to slip between the very fabric of space and slip between 2D and 3D. Well, what do you think? Mind-blowing, isn't it? <laughs> what is this A I speak of? I assure you that if we are being watched from another dimension, those beings will understand. <laughs> but you lack the mustache for full comprehension. Just remember that you can use this ability to find hidden items and secret pads. But beware, use your ability too long and you will lose HP. Okay. Holy cow. Are you, do you have a problem? I hate... Him. I didn't hate him before you started voicing him. <laughs> I love you. Oh, what is this uh, flipping ability that we just got? You will have to figure that out tomorrow. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, like and subscribe and turn off ad blocks, you jerks. Alright, good night. Good night.